And the next two lines I like to take together. Clear fountain, peaceful waters, turbulent river, stormy ocean. And they sound opposite, right? It's all about water, clear fountain, peaceful water, turbulent river, stormy ocean. And this really calls back the, the marriage of those six harmonies and all the underlying principles, especially the martial arts applications of the movements. Tai Chi is a way to address an opponent. It is a martial art. It is strong. And the energy that you have with the focus, as we say in the internal harmonies, motivation moves into concentration and focus, which moves into action. That motivation, that focus, that action is that uh, turbulent river, that stormy ocean. It's powerful against your opponent. But if you don't have a clear fountain, peaceful waters, which is this, if you are not focused, if you are not clear in your mind what your intent is and what you're trying to do, you're not going to be successful. You can't go into a fight like this. <laughs> that you can't be all over the board in your mind. You have to be focused, calm in your mind, powerful in your body. That turbulent river, stormy ocean is the power, but you have to control this and focus and go into it as peaceful warrior. So now we're going to do our brush knee, putting together the underlying principles with the harmonies, with that idea of how powerful this move is against your opponent, as long as you're focusing and keeping your mind peaceful. If you do your brush knee, Thinking about your rotation, remember how powerful that is. Keeping your columns intact, your shoulders in harmony with your hips. Moving from the Dantian, you keep yourself rooted and grounded using that energy from the ground to come against your opponent. You keep your eyes on your opponent, eyes on the horizon. This is a powerful movement. If we lose our focus, if we, if we come into it in a rage and not in a peace, we, may, we might try to strike like this. And now clearly I'm off balance and my opponent actually has the advantage. If I'm focused on the intent of my movement, I can use my energy against my opponent and I'm in control with my mind. Brush knee. Brush knee. One more step. Let's do that brush knee again and try to marry in your mind the idea of power and peacefulness. Using those underlying principles to keep your body in control, to keep your mind in the moment, focused on what you're trying to accomplish. One more step. And the last line, with your whole being, develop your life. And you can take that as far as you want to. I like to think about it as with everything that you do, you're trying to be the best you can be. And Tai Chi is a piece of that puzzle. With everything that you do, emotionally, mentally, physically, spiritually, everything that you do is focused on being the best you can be. 
You are a unique gift to the world, and we need you to be the best you can be. We need your gifts. Every one of us needs to be giving each other our gifts. So with your whole being, develop your life. Like I said, Tai Chi is an important piece of that puzzle. It helps you with your relaxation. It helps you with your focus, keeping your mind peaceful, keeping you uh, focused on what you need to be doing in each situation. Mm -hmm.